Is this the 1700s? <laughs> no, that, yes. that's the next floor down. Oh, okay. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. You're welcome. <laughs> We are on our way to Scotland for a couple of days. Kind of a spur of the moment trip. We get to go with our good buddy, Sarah. Hello. She was kind enough to invite us to her place. We're gonna go up to the Highlands. Don't really have much planned. We do have a whiskey tour book. Gonna try and see a little bit of the countryside. Should be fun. Yeah, we're excited. Yay, Scotland. Scotland. It doesn't have the same sound, yeah. but Scotland. we need to come up with the Scotland cheer. Yeah, yeah. Freedom. Cool. 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 Driving on the other side of the road. Yeah. How is it? It's fun. Kind of a weird mind twist. It kind of threw me off when I almost turned onto the right side of the street back there. Mm -hmm. We're all still alive. We're just following Sarah to her house, which is cool. Got to the Crag and Moore Whiskey Distillery, and we're gonna do a tour. He's gonna drink it all. Yeah, all of the whiskey. <laughs> yeah. No, we we booked this trip short notice, and we looked at a whole bunch of different distilleries. There's a bunch around here that are like super famous, but they were all booked out. We were lucky to find this one. It's called the Crag and Moore. Actually, never heard of their whiskey, but I'm excited to try it out. More excited to learn how it's made. Give it a go. Yeah. Is it a nice meal to come in? There are three main ingredients to make more How'd you like the little sniff test over there? Oh, it's like a slap in the face. Yeah? Make yeah. you thirsty? No. <laughs> you? Yeah, I'm excited to try it. Following our whiskey tour, Sarah took us on a tour of some of her favorite spots in the Scottish Highlands. Can we just take a few minutes of the video to talk about how amazing of a person she is? When we booked flights for this trip, the only reasonable fares we could find back from the UK were from Edinburgh. Since this particular trip was always more about Wales, the original plan was to spend as much time as we could there, and then maybe a quick teaser day in Edinburgh before we flew out. But when Sarah heard our plans, she invited us to her home in the Highlands. And when a legendary local invites you to stay in their home, in one of the most beautiful places on the planet, you say yes. We're so glad we did. After seeing some of her favorite spots, we drove back to her house and hung out with her family and her dog, Jack. They were all so hospitable, welcoming us into their home, feeding us and helping us with our last minute plans. We hope we can one day return the hospitality but even more, look forward to staying with them again sometime soon. Triumphant. 
elephant circle this morning with Sarah as our driver. Dusty in the back. Sitting in the back seat. Noisy can I take? Island Coos! Island Coos! Find some better skipping rocks. No. No? But we've made it to a proper Scottish loch. Loch This is what? Uh, loch Loch Lochy. Which is basically <laughs> Lake Lakey. Apparently this is the loch to go to if you don't want to deal with the overrun crowds. terrace crowds. At Loch Ness? Yeah, because we're just one loch to the south of Loch Ness. And it can be 250 meters deep. I'll be damned. We just got to Fort Augustus, which is the southern starting point of exploring Loch Ness. Go find Nessie? Yeah. Keeping our eye out for a restaurant. But also keep an eye out for Nello Nessie. We have a bet going. The first to find Nessie is a good prize. What's the prize? I took it to the madhouse. Oh, sweet. That'll be fun. <laughs> Apparently they have canals here with locks on them, which at first I thought would be confusing because the word loch with the C-H means lake here. Obviously loch ness means lake ness. But we call these things loch, which are pretty much little chambers in a canal where you can adjust the level of the water so the boats can navigate through. And I thought that would be super confusing because they're also called locks. But apparently lake is locked with a C-H and so they say it's more loch. And this is locked with a C-K. Isn't that correct? It is. And it runs into loch ness. Oh, you can see a little bit of it right, right there. Let me zoom. Right there. Oh, there it is. Loch Ness. Keep an eye out for old Nessie. Oh, well, when you're zoomed in, that gets really touchy. There we go. Great content, guys. Warning, dudes. Warning. We are headed back to the airport. Say goodbye to Sarah this morning, which sucked. I hate goodbyes. But it was a little less bitter because there's a chance she'll be coming to Utah to go skiing. Which crossed. Yeah. What did you think of Scotland, dude? It is beautiful. It was a little bit more of a tease just because it was more of an afterthought we added on to the end of the trip because Edinburgh was the only place we could find flights home from. So it was really just a couple days tacked onto this trip, but it's not enough to do Scotland. Just scratch the surface. <laughs> not beautiful. At all. This drive was amazing. We did manage to see some Highland Coos. Highland Coos! Which is really cool. And quite a lot of the countryside. We spent a lot of time just driving through to see what Scotland had to offer. Which yeah. is freaking gorgeous. Sarah's a freaking champ. She just took a whole day yesterday and just drove us around in a big old boot. Scotland. Saw uh, Fort Augustus and Inverness and what was the Loch tallest Ness. called? Yeah, we saw yeah, Loch Ness. Uh, ben Nevis? Nevis. Ben Nevis, Nevis, which apparently is the tallest mountain in the UK. Which was really cool. Pretty impressive. If you get a chance to come to Scotland. Take it. Come up to the Highlands. Beautiful. And you know, when you get a chance to just go stay in the house of the local in Islands. That's what you do. Also, meeting Sarah's parents was amazing. They're just sweethearts of people. Welcomed us into their home, cooked us dinner. Incredibly hospitable. Like, Some of the most amazing, people. loveliest people I've met. Dad had a beautiful Scottish accent, and her mom's Dutch so accent. Sweet. Just a sweetheart of a lady. It was a beautiful stay. It was amazing. Can't Sarah wait to come back. Bye. Bye.